Hello, everyone. Welcome back. Um, this is a really exciting day, and you can already see by the color how happy this video is going to be today. I'm so excited. So if you're new here, hello, I'm Rachel, and this is Merciful Mornings. This is where you come for education, encouragement, and support for online teaching and also daily life. We're definitely online teaching today. And I am so excited to have Miss Victoria Gillick with me today. She is so smart. Like I just, I'm constantly learning. For, I know people say things like that about you and then you're like, oh crud. But I'm going to say it anyway, because what you see behind her is hers. Like it's her creation. And I'm just always in awe when I see these virtual backgrounds. So the goal today, uh, we're going to hear from Victoria and I want to kind of hear your teacher journey and how you got to hey, now I'm making virtual backgrounds and teaching other people how to do it. Because I love hearing teachers who started just as teachers and then took whatever skills they had to grow something new, a new business, a new experience, um, something to offer others. So that's the journey you're going to take us on today, if that's okay. Um, but before we do all that, just tell everybody who you are, what you're about, your life story, whatever you want. Go. Oh, yes. I love it. <laughs> Thank you, Rachel. You are awesome, as always. Um, if you're not already part of her following or part of that subscribe, definitely subscribe because I'm one of those that is not... I. I don't set my mornings and Rachel always has a beautiful, wonderful, warm, heartwarming message. And it's a great way to start your day. Um, whether you're following her on Instagram or on her channels, that's, it's Thank really you. nice place to get centered. I love it because <laughs> I feel connected and there's a sense of normalcy that comes from speaking and sharing, well, sharing your truth. Yeah. And um, I'm so glad to have just that few, that few extra minutes to say, you know what? I am feeling this. Yay. I'm so, <laughs> so I get it. I get it. So <laughs> thank I, you. And I, I, pr I, share that because I I am so thankful and appreciative to connect with Rachel and a couple of other friends that we have in our circle that have supported us along our journey. Mm -hmm. And we're talking about journeys today. And that is, I, I just like many others in uh, that are out doing entrepreneurships or starting businesses or just becoming a little bit more creative or even reconnecting with a gift that they've had when they were younger, um, this is the time to do it. And that's kind of where I come in. I, I didn't hand draw or do any of the watercolors on this background. However, I do do a lot of blending of watercolor paintings, drawing and sketches on a lot of my signature backgrounds. This is something that I've created out of Canva, and it's something that um, I have found in the classroom that starts conversations. And as an ESL online teacher, conversations are the root of establishing rapport, making those connections, and just keeping a student engaged um, throughout your class because, oh, did you see the turtle? <laughs> Sometimes just making or taking that break to pull back, which we all do, um, whether we're, you know, we kind of zone out a bit and we can check in. I really do like to encourage people when they're creating spaces, whether it's in the classroom or on a virtual platform in the virtual space that you should use colors that really speak to you, yeah. that um, tell a story or maybe connect you to a moment that you kind of want to have in your day that day. For example, the, the inspiration for the background here is Arizona. Um, I have not visited Arizona in about two, maybe three years. And someone very special or many special people live in Arizona. Uh, my family, there's our butterflies to represent my family and the changes that everybody's going through. Um, so these are things I that- I love it. I love yes. all this. And I love, you said you pulled these from Canva. That's something even yes. I can do. I'm not an artist. I'm not going to draw it. Now, you know, my daughter, she's the artist. She yes, the I love it. <laughs> but I am not. And so to think like I could even do this just you using something can. like Canva- 
that makes it so much more attainable for someone like me. <laughs> oh, yes. And everybody has that creativity or something that they're passionate about or even a message that they want to communicate throughout the day. And uh, Canva is is one of the platforms that I use to create backgrounds. Um, and I do on my channel, I share every now and then I'll share how I create the space, maybe a sneak peek, uh, maybe drawing or a project that I'm doing. I know that I worked on um, one of my passions is reading. And since we, we are educating yes. students and children, I've made backgrounds that had, um, the rabbit, the white rabbit. <laughs> That's yes. one of my favorite because it adds animation. So think about blending these spaces. I show uh, maybe walkthroughs or just tips on how to make it um, a movable or interactive space. Now, I mentioned, and I know that you talked about the backgrounds for classrooms. Now this is a static one where uh, if you're presenting and you don't want to distract the student too much, um, right. this would be what I would use. I would also use this in conjunction or with um, a more interactive mini classroom. And I teach others how to do both types. There's two types. If this was a mini classroom, I might have, um, oh, you can see my, my background in there. <laughs> I <I'm, love> it. <laughs> when I move, isn't that great? <laughs> <laughs> That's so real. Um, yeah. there's so I also teach people how to use their space if they don't have a green screen, which today I do not. I'm actually in a different state from my home. I love it. You can take your background with you. Yeah, um, I love that because this, this is not going with me. I have to do something <laughs> else if I'm traveling so that it looks decently like a classroom you just like pick up and go and have it with oh yeah you. I do I do I have at least you know I have at least four three or four um now I have quite a few more that I just yeah. switch in and out um and depending on the lighting um you'll see different it, it gives you a different kind of impact cleaner lines halos you can blur your background depending yeah. on the tools that you use but the interactive classrooms are those that have um, in in the course that I'm teaching? I'm teaching a course. Yeah, hey, oh, and we're out. gonna. I want to yes. hear all about that. <laughs> so finish what you're saying, and then we want to yes. hear about this course. <laughs> and also, I will say before we move too forward, if you are like, yes, I want all these things that she's talking about, check the description because I'm gonna drop all of her links below her YouTube channel this course that she's about to tell us about that I'm super excited about, but any of her stuff, obviously this is not my forte. This is not what I excel at. So if you want to jump into Victoria's genius zone and learn from her, all those links are going to be below in the description box. Okay. Carry on. I love it. Things. I so Squirrel. love it. Squirrel, <laughs> You're, squirrel, go. Yes, that is exactly. And the butterflies remind me that, you know, slow it down, Victoria. <laughs> <laughs> so it, it's one of those things. Um, the interactive classroom, it's, this is part of my journey. I was, um, m like many individuals, I was a dis I wasn't displaced. I actually was a military spouse. We moved mm -hmm. um, part of our PCS or permanent change of station. And I was, you know, I had to say goodbye to a lovely work family, a different kind of mindset going into work. But yes. also during that time, the pandemic hit. And uh, I found myself learning so many new skills on the computer with VIP Kid, online teaching resources. And I realized pretty early on, just like many of our friends and peers, and maybe just like you out there listening, yeah. that, that we needed something else. We needed to diversify. We needed to make sure that we were financially independent, that we were okay, whether mm -hmm. or not we needed that money or we felt the need to put it aside in case of an emergency. Right. We didn't know how long it was going to last, how it would impact impact us or globally mm -hmm. how it would impact us. So I started to go back to self-care and I know you talk about that a lot, taking oh, that yes. time out, drawing. <laughs> and my students started to, um, it started with a whiteboard, really. That's really where it started. And yeah. then they wanted it on the background. And then I had to learn how to do that. Then I had to learn how to include them in the background. And, and then um, I, some, a friend of mine from school 
found that I was doing this and said, hey, I need you on board. Um, let's collaborate. And we did this collaboration and it's the Heritage Team Extraordinaire. They have a wonderful, passionate mission about um, equity and education. They have all free resources, all free resources. And Amazing. One of the things- it's so much. Yes. You guys, it's so much stuff. Oh, you've got to check that place yeah. out. Link. I'm not, we'll link that yes. below too. <laughs> there, there's, you, you're looking at a team of teachers that have connected. We've all over the world. Um, I, I can't say that it's just the United States. We've connected with teachers um, globally and it's all for the mission to um, empower our students their learning styles, their unique origins, where they're, yes. where they're from and culture. And guess what? It's in one spot. We create these powerful um, mess these powerful classrooms. And that's why I mentioned interactive classrooms because yes. you'll have a story, a theme, kind of how it plays out. Um, we just released this over a hundred slide presentation. Yes. And each one of those slides represents a different country. And each one of those slides has the same things, Google map links, um, resources like uh, vetted resources that we have checked. Um, and our process has been approved by school districts. And we've presented at different conferences. So gold, share. gold is yes. what you're saying. We're this dropping gold. gold, liquid, gold liquid gold. It's right there. <laughs> it's and they're free. So this is Amazing. this is where my passion came in, where I could meld that creativity, show other teachers that you can do this, whether you're just starting out, that's I have a mini course that's um, you know, just that you can take in a weekend, you know, yeah, two days. And it. and then yes, and then the signature course that's coming out that's that is everything. You've got the mini in it. You've got one-on-one -on -one coaching. You've got access to Facebook group, um, you know, collaboration. So what are we and learning in this course? I'm ready. We are learning. We are learning. We are learning how to create static. We're learning how to create a theme. We're learning where to get legitimate resources, mm -hmm. safe YouTube clips, and how to cite our sources. Because if there's a teacher that's presenting at um, a conference or using yes. our materials, remember the applications are endless for how you use the material. So we want to make sure our, our resources are cited. We're giving credit where it's due yes. and that it's all in one spot. You've thought so, it all through. You've thought through yes. the whole thing. <laughs> we did, but I guess what? Even at the end of everything, if you want to go beyond that, if you want to be the champion and create your own mini classroom and market it and sell it, like, think about it. Yes. That's money in your pocket that, that you're already going to use because you're using it in your classroom. Now, like I said, the Heritage Team Extraordinaire has all free resources. We ask that you, that if you're using our resources, that you don't modify it or anything because these have been vetted. Right. But if you, we can teach you how to create your own mm -hmm. on your own, if you want to make it custom. Yeah. And then sell it. We're all about using <laughs> skills we have or gaining these new skills related to what we already love and using those to monetize, to make income Absolutely. from home. That is what we're, and that is, that's why you're here today, right? Yes. That's why I wanted to hear this is because this is within the realm, you know, of teaching of online teaching, but it's completely outside the scope of what I'm able to teach people. And I want to make sure all my people have all the resources <laughs> that they need to get out there and do the things they love. And so I adore that you've come up with all of this and you're putting it out there so people can either grow skills they already have, get back into their creative side or learn new things. Like, yes, that sounds fun. I want to do that and get out there and either use it in the classroom or monetize right. it. Either Absolutely. One. And think about the um, applications when you're using it in the classroom. Now, I know that we, I, maybe I'm alone. I'm like a little on a little <laughs> island, but I, I have a feeling that there are others out there that do their work in chunks like mm -hmm. that, that have like a burst of creative energy or even just energy and focus. Yes. And I, I just, I try to really 
I take advantage of that, that like mindset. Yes. And I do a lot of work all at once so that I don't have to do it later that I could sit on the beach, that I can have my Zen moment with my chai tea or my, uh, my water and go for a walk and listen to an audio book. <laughs> all the things that I really, that, that make me feel good. Those yes. are what I want to do more of. So yes. when I have those bursts of energies and I know Rachel, you and I connect on this because when you're out there, I I'm motivated too. I was like, man, she's taking that moment for that coffee and she's digging it. And it doesn't have to be like 15 minutes. It can be just a few minutes yes. of that centering time. And, and that's what I'm all about. I want those. I want to make it easy. If you take advantage of those times, if you, if you're not familiar with Rachel and her stuff, I say, do it, go <laughs> on her channel because she's going to help you get organized and kind of predict what it is, your task that you want to get done. And that's all about creating those, um, uh, those creative mini spaces, those mini classrooms, um, mm. follow Rachel's, um, ideas or themes for curriculum. And then you can take that curriculum and outline your mini background or your I mini that. classroom. I love and that. Think about it. You can take a vacation. You know, you're going to take vacation in July, but you also have to teach. Hey, use the same um, classroom in different times and it's already prepared for you. Right. You have all the resources. There's everything you need. I'll be over here sipping my drink yes. on the beach. Including, <laughs> and this is a bonus in the course, including learning how to make editable PDFs, meaning that you can type in there, create your own templates for um, maps, the like, um, the no, um, what is it? KWL the, chart. Yeah, I'm with you. I'm like, the, the no, I was like, like, oh no, that's, no, go I'm going it. totally off. That's not no, it. But you can like this. <laughs> want, to, want to know, learn. I don't remember. It's anyway. Yes, what, what I know, what I want to know, no. and what I have learned. Look, we are so. teachers. <laughs> I know we, there's so many ways to organize and to appeal to our students. Um, all of those, we, I kind of show you how to create your own um, templates to add as a supplement and to make it easier for your students and yourself. Um, so why not? I yes. love all these things. I'm <laughs> listen, I'm in, I'm all in. Okay. And Yay. yes, you know, you know, I'm a big pusher for the batching, for the block yes. scheduling, batch your content, get focused and knock it out and then move on with your day. Yes. Enjoy yes. your life. It's not working 24 seven. If you're working 24 seven, you're doing it wrong. Let's talk. I agree. I agree. <laughs> I, I am a napper. I am, if I am tired, if oh, I yes. want that moment, oh my gosh, it just, I am such a different person when I have that rest and it doesn't have like, I'm not napping for like six hours. I'm napping for like right. a, a right. short, but short, listen, you know. my children know. Okay. I, when I go to pick my kids up from school, my kids, will, mom, mom, did you get your nap today? Right. Like I, mom's cranky. She didn't nap today. <laughs> It's so true. Oh, we need our energy. Yes. And, and in order to protect that space and to make sure that you have that space, it's okay to, to um, prepare ahead of time. It's okay. I don't prep for any of my classes for any of them anymore. I, I checked out of that. I, I want to spend as much time um, self-reflecting, planning for the next moment, or mm -hmm. even creating new things, because those keep me at, at the energy that I, that makes it, yes. a, makes it worth it. That's you know, so That's self -care. self-care. You got to yes. take care of yourself. Yes. I love this so much. Okay. So <laughs> if somebody's like, yes, please, I want to learn to do this. And this could be a classroom brick and mortar teacher who's wanting to utilize these things or someone who's doing hybrid virtual, someone who's wanting to teach online independently. This is just you can do so much with this. So if we're all like, yes, please, Victoria, give me all the things. Tell us what's up. What is, what is this called? What can we get? Tell me all about it. So if you're still, if you still are, uh, because I, t I have a tendency to talk fast and I get it, but if you still want a little bit more background or if you're a visual person like myself, I've got a few workshops that are coming up in uh, next month, as a matter of fact, and I'll be sure to include um, 
merciful mornings on my tag so that anybody that uh, has connected here and wants to know more that you'll be able to kind of check out our tags together and oh guys she's including us i am including it oh i definitely do and i've got a surprise (laughs) too i i don't know if you follow if You've seen it, but I put on Instagram that her daughter is such a darling. Um, I am going to put in there. There's it's Llama Love Designs. Yes. I had this beautiful custom made T-shirt, and I w- planned on wearing it today, but I got so excited. I wore it for my <laughs> classes the other day, and That's now so it's funny. like hanging up to dry, and because I want to keep it, it's so gorgeous. <laughs> and I wore it all day, and people were looking at me and pointing. I was like, "Yeah, that my T-shirt." That's <laughs> and it's so- me. Fun. It looks just it like is. me. She made it to be you. She did. She had your little picture and made it to be you. So this is my 12 year old, you guys. This is my little yes. entrepreneur who she does her own like graphic design drawings. I mean, she does regular drawings too, but these that she's doing anyway, she's like, mom, I need an Etsy store. I want to put these need to be on like shirts and stickers and mugs. So I'm like slowly getting that going anyway you're sweet for mentioning it but she loves it it was adorable it was it's just one of those things that like I said everything connects um I love that she's starting her journey and that my journey may have been a little bit later than hers but it's still connecting to things that I was passionate about when I was younger Mm -hmm. um I just I wrote a story um, and it became something bigger. And that is also coming out this summer. Um, I've collaborated with an illustrator. I, I learned how to draw in a year. Um, I didn't have any drawing or anything at all. Um, and during this pandemic, I learned how to draw. So um, yes, some of my stuff is a little basic, but I it's something that I connected to. So if you're, if you're from zero, you can get to wherever you want to be. This is these courses and these tips are all designed for that one-on-one experience. And, you know, I just wanted to say that there, that, you know, if you have zero, if you're drawing stick figures, that's okay. Um, We all understand, (laughs) we all understand what, you know, the, you know, the, this the happy, the happy yes. like this. Right. Like, or I get my point across. <laughs> <laughs> it's that's exactly where we're at from zero, well, from beginner to um, you know, from beginner to we make it virtually easy. We're going from um, beyond from beginner to champion and champion and beyond. That's where we're going. And oh, like right. I said, wherever you're at in your journey we can chat. Um, we are releasing our course. Oh, this is the scary part, right? Oh, it's this is the so awesome scary. part. <laughs> scary, exciting. I love it because all of that fun energy is going to mix together. And I am so excited to encourage and support anybody that wants to do this because I know that we have so many talented people. It's about making those connections that are going to help you get through the yes. next year, the year after that, we yes. are incorporating technology more and more in our classroom. And these are the places that you're going to learn. There's going to be a brief, um, not a one-on-one in module, but there's going to be some um, additional tools for people using Pear Deck, um, oh, cards, decks. <laughs> oh, the, like the boom? The, the boom, boom cards, cards. Yes. yes. And different things. I Again, that's that's just something that's going to be bonus material in this. Um, so, so cool. Yes. The modules are basically going to walk us through creating our own interactive and then providing, you know, a price tag for it if that's what you want. Um, yeah. That is where we're leading with this, this course that's being So released. do we have a day? June 11th. It's a Friday. I'm really excited about that. So you'll see um, some work coming up about that. Um, And just know that I celebrate everybody's passion um, where it it is. And I want to see it. This is, listen, this is the sweetest, most encouraging girl. If you are not following (laughs) Victoria Finder, all her links are below. You need to follow her. Go to, she's got YouTube channel, Instagram. It's just, it's a happy place to be. I mean, look, look at the butterflies. <laughs> yes. No, no, look at the butterflies. Look at the Come butterflies. closer. <laughs> 
I would add some butterflies in there. I think that would be nice to draw, a, you know, a unique butterfly or to put um, maybe a bitmoji of yourself in here or a bitmoji of the student that you're going to teach yeah. or even a clip for or something that you want to say on top. That's why it's blank here. I took out the hello or welcome um, to name the course so that there's always some kind of direction. Again, any of these backgrounds, um, I do have a few available. If you're looking for one-on-one -on -one, um, backgrounds or a custom background, I do have links and we'll share that with Rachel as well. Yay, y'all check her out. She's awesome sauce. I'm so excited for all of these things I want in. We'll just say like, I don't know where I'm gonna cram it, but I'm a bulk block, whatever <laughs> I need to do. Cause I need all the things I'm excited excited and if nothing else like you know my daughter's gonna want to learn all the things so oh yes <laughs> we're here for it we're excited check out Victoria if this was helpful for you if you like this video be sure to like it and share it with anybody else that you think would be interested excited wanting to jump on board this was so fun thanks for chatting with me today not a problem thank you for having me on I feel centered I feel motivated mm -hmm. and I am so ready to connect with everybody out there I'm wishing everybody a lovely day thank you so much Rachel yay thank you Victoria we'll see you guys in the next video bye-bye